What it is, y'all, it is your old boy Pilk, and I'm coming back at you today with more Damachi. Now, first of all, I want to get one thing out of the way here today. Uh, and unfortunately, it, it, I was completely wrong about the uh, banner for Argonaut and Fina, in that I did report that it was going to get a ticket. Um, there were some questions whether it would be 11 draw or whether it was going to be this or that or the other thing. I went back through the data. There was actually nothing there. My brain put something together from that other... Uh, some of you guys did actually call this out. and There was apparently a lot of confusion on this, but the end of the day is I was unfortunately wrong. You were not going to get an opportunity to free draw on that banner, which absolutely sucks. Really does. Um... I still, in my heart of hearts, believe you should only get one. I've seen people that have MLB'd them, and I think that's a really silly prospect. Uh, probably uh, for another video. But the long and the short of it is, I apologize for being wrong on that. Um, I took something out of context from the news, and I've not done that before, so I'll be a little more cautious with that uh, in the future. Um, had a few things wrong in the news before, but I've never had anything wrong quite to that degree so my deepest apologies and i'm going to make sure we rectify that going forward now let's talk about the new event most importantly farming the new event uh as you may or may not know that goes up to boss 131 now there's only a handful of bosses here i think seven in total which would coincide with the ex information six in total maybe then um and as you fight through this, you get the different story modes. And these are literally the story modes for the different gotchas we're going to be getting. Like, basically, you're going to be able to read through the story once again. Um, now, here's the deal. We're not going to get anything open until the very end of 17 days from now, 18 days into the event. Um, that said, it seems like, it, it seems like you get the same amount of... Uh, rewards from the from this event as you would from the end of the actual tale itself. So you may actually be able to start farming now. Now I'm going to be real. I would not go too crazy until we know for sure that that's what's going to happen. We have an opportunity to compare the some of the later on stories. So I would still not go too crazy farming, but I don't think the rewards are going to get any different going forward. My opinion. So we get 55 of the gacha tickets, right about 54 of the gacha tickets, 9 or 10 of the large item, 15 of the uh, medium item, and 37 of the small item. I want to say that's pretty close to, if not right in line with the end of a tale, which would make sense because it's like the end of each tale, more or less. So you should have absolutely no problems going in here. And farming this up, I just wouldn't spend a whole bunch of potato snacks quite yet. Let a few of these open up, see if you're getting the same number of rewards, and then start blowing your potato snacks and going crazy. Because I'd hate for you to farm this too early and then just not get the rewards you can you get out of it. Now, I've heard people say they can't beat the very hard in this, and I'd be shocked by that. Absolutely shocked by that. Uh, these opponents really are not that tough. Uh, they only have 117,000 health, which sounds like a lot, but... Throw Otaril at this if you have Otaril, and he'll just wreck him in no time. It's going to be hilarious. Um, yeah, this is not a tough event by any stretch of the imagination. Now, we do have an EX, and we'll talk about that after we talk about the exchange and the gotcha, because the EX is a whole different animal. Um, but there we go. More rewards. Bada bing, bada boom. There we go. Now, Let's talk about the exchange, and we'll talk about the gacha. The exchange, once again, has hero metal and flame amulet. Make sure you get those guys, because remember, that's the thing that you exchange for st uh, for prism bonds. Not star bonds, unfortunately, but prism bonds. Hero light and ascension fallen. We kind of expect that. Gnome tickets, we expect that. And there are gnome tickets as well in the um, uh, in in the uh, the missions. So getting up to 5,500... Of the large items will get you all the gnome tickets in the uh, in the missions. I forget how many that is in total, but it's an ass load, and you should always shoot to do that. You should always aim to get 5,500 a total of the large items. It, it takes a while. That's why I say you might not. It might not be bad to start farming now, but mm, I'd still wouldn't go too crazy. Okay, 
But you do get potato snacks, and there are two people always asking me how to get potato snacks. Farm these events, you'll get potato snacks. And if you're at saying, well, you told me not to go too crazy farming this, what about you know getting potato snacks? I wouldn't blow potato snacks at this juncture farming this. Just log in two, three times a day, burn your stamina gauge, let it build back up, and do it again. I don't think it's time to really start burning and going nuts yet. Once again, let two or, the, two or three of these open. Let's make sure we're getting the right, the same number. Because I suspect we will, but I just don't know. It's it's still an unknown at this point. But if we are still getting the same number of rewards from all of these, then you can go ham. Now, here's the fun part. All of these four-star guaranteed tickets, you could pick one. And you know what really sucks about this? Contrary to the, the banners they showed us before, these are now broken up exactly like the banners we got from those events. So the Argonaut banners are broken up into two banners. The uh, Winter Tail banner is broken up into two banners. So on and so forth. So, those are the only two actually. <coughs> I'm gonna edit that out. So, no I won't. So, you guys have been asking me what to do with these and it's gonna be 17 days before we can even get them. So if I'm entirely honest, I will drop that video closer to the time that we're going to be doing this maybe a day or two out so you guys can start planning you'll only be able to pick one i know some of us got excited when we went in here you'll be able to pick one it's kind of like the heroic trial turned up to 11 instead of only picking one of the three or four bonds you pick one banner one banner nice part is you can still blow iris on these banners so that's great news um not that i would but Eek, 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 to my whales, they know what that means. So, which one to hit? Well, once again, that's going to be a subject of its own video, but my answer to you is if you blow this ticket, the solo single 11 draw, then you're going to get free to play. If you blow this on a banner that is not time limited, you are a fool. Save this ticket for a time limited banner case in point if you guys remember uh we got a valentine's event last year but this year we had the, the goblin slayer crossover at the same time so we did not get a rerun of that event and we did not get a new event this year so there's a possibility that some of these events might not rerun that's a real possibility so if you have this ticket Always consider time limited units absolutely first. And for me, and you don't have Winter Haruhime, she's my number one. I don't. You, you ask me that in two weeks' time when we make the video, it'll still be the same. Winter Haruhime is still number one. But if you have her, pick a different banner because if you have a bond of her, you can always throw star bonds. You can't pick up new time limited units unless there's a rerun. And usually, by the time there's a rerun, they're not really relevant anymore. But I digress. That's my answer to that. Let's move on. We'll, we'll, once again, that's going to be its own video. We get event unit tickets. Uh, that's basically for the... Um, uh, that's the exchange for the drop units from the game previous. Uh, that's really good for Sirios. Faith Stones. Make sure you get all your Faith Stones, guys. They are limited. And make sure you're donating your Faith Stones every single day. Because I'm really bad at that myself. Smelting Stones and Wet Stones. Nothing, to be, you know, nothing new or exciting there. We've had those forever. Two-star tickets, once again, nothing new or exciting, but do not forget to farm up these two-star tickets. Two-star tickets always have a chance to turn into four-stars. If you do not farm these up, you miss it out. And, of course, Falna is not time-limited. That hasn't been a thing in a bit of time. So, you, if you have any leftover large items, you can always drop it on Falna. Lord knows, I, I've finally been stocking up on Falna, so it feels good. Let's go back here. And, oh, we didn't talk about the gacha. Let's talk about the gacha. Okay. Uh, the gacha is, once again, I believe, still 15 rounds with a three star ticket. After that, we'll probably get uh, the um, uh, hero fauna, and that's really hard to drop anyway. Tons of CP items, large books, uh, medium books, small books, large fauna, medium fauna, small fauna. Just. Your general gotcha. Nothing really new or outstanding here. Hey, I got my ticket right on the first one. 
nice that so just make sure you're farming this it's not new it's not different it is just what is what it is so that is everything except for the ex levels okay here's the interesting thing about ex levels if they're introducing this now start preparing start thinking about what you're going to do going forward because the ex levels most likely if they're adding them here will be introduced with the anniversary i'm predicting that now i suspect ex levels will probably be introduced during the anniversary as a way for us to kind of normalize the flow of hero uh hero lights and hero ascension or i'm sorry ascension fauna so i was going to cover the ex run in the same video but uh it turned out to be really really long and i'm going to go ahead and cut it here if you guys want to see the ex run and get all the skinny on that i'm going to go ahead and upload that as a second video here in just a few minutes so you'll have that to digest in and of itself on your own so you don't have to like skip around this video for all that stuff for now, guys, that will be the video. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'll be back at you guys with more Damachi, uh, I guess, in a few minutes.